everyone, I am Shell Miranda and I am your host for this afternoon. And of course, welcome everyone to DOST PTRI's project presentation. But first, let me share with you this bolero that I am wearing right now. It's also from DOST PTRI and it is made up of pure silk, a beautiful creation. And of course, I think we should all be proud that the Philippines can be able to produce different kinds of textile. So, to officially welcome us all, may I invite here on the stage the director of DOST Philippine Textile Research Institute, no other than the ever gorgeous <laughs> Director Celia B. Elum. Good afternoon. And ang um, kanina na share ko sa nakakarami that this particular project brought us to work with so many collaborators. Um, six national government agencies. Alam niyo po, if you're working in government, hindi po madali kang kilapin yung aming po mga kasamahan sa kapwa naming ahensya. Nasabi mo na kami magkakapatid sa gobyerno, lahat po kami nagkakapunan. So para po sila ay mapaupo namin sa isang pag-uusap at para po sila ay um, pumayag at uh, makisalo sa amin at makihalubilo dito sa proyekto na ito, napakalaking halaga po iyon at maraming maraming salamat po sa ating mga kasamahan sa gobyerno. So sa Civil Service Commission, aming po malaking pasasalamat at we are very honored, particularly because mismo yung ating chair has been very instrumental and has been really uh, been very supportive uh, in coming out to really also be part of this exercise. Uh, ang Civil Service Commission po, sila po ang ating tinatagurian ng Super HR ng gobyerno. Sa kanila po, ang lahat po ng mga kasamahan natin sa gobyerno, uh, sila po talaga ang nagtatalaga at sila ang nakatutok at nakabantay. At kung hindi po nalalaman, sila din po ang kumbaga ay monitoring agency in charge of the Philippine <coughs> Tropical Fabric uh, Utilization in the Philippines. So maraming maraming salamat po sa inyo. Kasama rin po natin dito ang mga uh, kasama natin sa National Economic Development Authority. Nasaan po ang mga kasama natin sa NEDA? Thank you very much for being with us. So babalikan ko lang po ang Civil Service Commission. Nasaan po ang mga taga Civil Service Commission? Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you very much. Um, sa ating pong kasamahan sa Department of Foreign Affairs, Yay! Thank you very much. Our Department of Trade and Industry. As well as the Department of Foreign Affairs. Modelo, modelo, the Department of Foreign Affairs. No? And of course, not the least of all, the Department of Science and Technology. Can you come to my own the Department of Science and Technology? Pagkagalapag po ng aming apondo ay nandito. Maraming pong salamat po making this possible. Ako ang ating innovation council ang t-shirt. So, um, I mentioned that we have been working with so many national government agencies and this was not a small feat, but it was a fantastic opportunity, a wonderful opportunity kasi gusto po natin ang mapalawang kaalaman sa paggamit ng Philippine Tropical Fabric. At itong unang-unang po meeting namin, would you believe when we ask the question, how many of you are aware that there is such a role or a law as RA 9242 and it is a Philippine Tropical Fabric Act? There were six government agencies represented, only one was aware. So this was a wonderful opportunity to bring this to a higher level of awareness for all of our other government partners in the government agency system. Um, gusto ko pong pasalamatan ang iba pong mga kasamata natin o sa nabagik yung alin. Uh, mula po din sa six government agencies na yun, nagtalaga sila ng 32 model civil servants. Na hindi pa po yan gawad-gawad ng CSC o ng CESB, pero sila po ay natulingan na ng model civil servants, model government employees. So huwag po natin kalimutan, ito pong pagtatahan na ito, this is a runway presentation of a project output. Hindi po ito fashion show, kaya po ginawa natin siya ang hapon at hindi po natin maaaring kalimutan na ito po ay para sa mga kawani ng pamahalaan, civil servants uh, of the government system. Um, at gusto natin po na ipakita na marami pong pagkakagin, maraming opportunities. This is meant to give us uh, inspiration, encouragement, uh, so that we will really take a good look at what we can do. And this morning, we had a wonderful presentation from the president of the Unimoda. It's a wonderful way of us to also get re 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 introduced to each other's activities. And so we are very grateful. Um, 
ang ating mga kasabahan ng mga young social entrepreneurs. Pwede ko po ba silang maimitan? Sila po ay aming source of encouragement. Nandito pa po ba ang ating mga kasamahan ng social entrepreneurs? Nandito po si, si Anya from Ant Hill. Um, is Kai is still here? Okay, okay. So uh, marami po kanina tayo mga kasamahan. But again, our gratitude for your continued support for the Texas sector. Um, at marami po mga ibang kasamahan tayo from government. Hindi ko na po wakang hindi na kasi marami po ang nakita. Kasama rin po sa mga academic community or partners natin, nandito rin po sila. Um, gusto ko pong uh, sa pagkakataon na ito, kasi po mamaya, mabibilisan lang natin yung ating pasasalamat kasi marami po tayong dapat na picture taking photo op, no? Uh, because it is an opportunity. We always want to be able to show this very visually and very graphically for most of our own counterparts in our own agencies or offices to also appreciate. So, pakasalamatan ko lang po ngayon ng mga kasamahan natin sa panel or selection committee. Um, kung maaari po na from our national government agencies, sa ating pong civil service commission, si, uh, um, I apologize, uh, sorry, from the Department of Foreign Affairs, si Andre Peter Estanislao. From the Department of Science and Technology, Dr. Diana L. Ignacio. Sorry, technical pitch. sa ating uh, selection committee, um, I'm very happy that uh, Ms. Ruth Canlas from the Non-Fever Forest Products Exchange Program is with us here. Sila po ang ating partner sa ating traditional textiles or indigenous weaves. Very grateful to the Vice President of Administration, Ms. Rita Abad. <laughs> Mr. Q. Prastrana, a uh, stalwart in media advertising and marketing. Uh, next to key, to Q, of course, is Ms. Jean Bowen of the Silk Cocoon. And we have Kinito Pastrana. Thank you very much for being with us today. All right, so with much, without much further ado, uh, I would like to uh, take this occasion once again to thank all of you and to also remind you that this is really our friends in government. So we want to make this a friendly environment. Um, we would like to really rally them on. But at the same time, let's not forget that there is a competition. We had invited some of our premier designers to make for us, for three days of the week, on Monday, Tuesday, and Gala wear, uh, outfits that will be good for our public servants. Um, not to forget though, that hindi naman natin ibig sabihin na araw-araw ibig suot natin o magkakaiba. No? This is really to widen the choices or the selection for the government agencies. At the same time, meron tayong competition proper. This is engaged in by young professionals and we received a good number of entries and this was really fantastic effort on everybody's part. Uh, ang aming pong promise dito, we invite the government agencies who participated. Hindi namin po sila ino-obliga. No obligation. Uh, we just wanted to really work with them very closely on the exercise, but we would encourage that if you would like to adopt any of the patterns or the designs that are going to be presented today that were crafted for you, then please let us know because we will projectize it. Ang commitment namin is that we will do what we can to make sure that we make PTF, the law in itself, something that can really be affected. Uh, and so with, uh, without much further ado, I present to you Today, of course, ang DOS, the PTRI, katuwang ang iba't ibang ahensya ng gobyerno sa pagpapatupad ng ganito nga programa. Of course, alam natin ang advokasiya ng ating ahensya. At kung lahat po tayo magkakaisa na suportahan at i-promote ang Philippine Textile, lahat ito ay magiging tagumpay nating lahat, of course, ng bansang Pilipinas. 